All right, guys, here are five easy tips that I will guarantee you will impress any female you go on a date with, whether you've met her online, whether you met her through a friend, or you just met her casually. If you follow these steps, I will guarantee you, you will impress women everywhere. Tip number one, under any circumstance, trust me, do not send a pic of your genitalia to a female, especially if she has not requested it. So many of my female friends, and you can ask your single female friends, how many of them block their Instagram profile because they get unsolicited pics? Seriously, were you brought up in a cave that, where there are no women around and when you finally see one, you just, your first thought is, oh, she wants to see my junk. She doesn't want to see your junk. Trust me on this. If you really feel compelled that you have to show your masterpiece to the world, send it to gay men. They will, two things will happen. One, they will appreciate it. And two, they'll be able to give you constructive feedback because gay men have seen way more penises than women have. So. No matter what, do not send a pic of your genitalia to a female. Rule number two. Now, this is the assumption I'm making that you actually find this woman attractive and you are interested in more. Take initiative. I have set up so many of my friends and I get the call next day from my female friend saying, hey, yeah, he didn't ask for my number. He didn't set up a follow-up date. And I'm thinking, okay. So I call my friend and I go, oh, I, did you find her attractive? He's like, oh yeah, I thought she was really cute. And I go, did you get her number? Oh no, I was kind of timid. What? Seriously? It, are we in such a state of the world that asking someone for their phone number who you've actually gone on a date with is intimidating? Take initiative. There is nothing sexier in a man than a man who takes initiative. Women will love this. Don't be vague, don't do this. Oh, maybe we can together next week. No, no, no. What are you doing on Wednesday? If Wednesday doesn't work, let me know what date works for you. Take initiative, women will love it. Rule number three, and I am going a little bit old school here, and you may have to Google this word to make sure you're clear on what it means. Be a gentleman. I know it's a totally dying art, Look, women will appreciate this. If you set up the date, I personally believe it is your responsibility as the male to pick up your date. Now, you don't have to take her to a fancy dinner, but you should pay for the drink. You should pay for the coffee. Just be a complete gentleman. That's it, you know, open the door. If you can open the door, I mean, seriously, when I go on a date and someone opens my door, psst, we're hitting it. It's, it's a done deal. Just because it's such a rare thing to experience. So be a gentleman. It will go a long, long way, trust me. So just to recap, no dick pic, you've taken initiative and you've been a total gentleman. And here's one part where I think a lot of men really fail. Just because you did all of those things, do not assume or expect that a woman is supposed to put out, perform any kind of oral pleasures on you or anything like that. Seriously, just because you were a decent human being does not mean you're gonna get rewarded with sex or with anything else. So your only expectation should be is for you to walk in and just knock this out of the park. Be the best version of yourself. Be kind, be smart, be funny. Showcase yourself to this person and let them know and let them see what makes you worthy of dating. At the end of the day, if you don't find her attractive or she doesn't find you attractive, if you were a total gentleman, I can guarantee you that a woman will be more than happy to refer you to one of her friends if she doesn't think you're, it's a match for her. Guaranteed. Now also, there's a good chance you're gonna run into this woman in the future. Do you wanna be that guy that was a total jerk? No. Be nice, be a gentleman, impress. Show up to impress from the way you look, the way you act, the way you treat her, and there are no expectations. All right, and the final step, at the end of your date, whether you're interested in this woman or you're not interested in this woman, Either way, use your words. If you're not interested, and you don't have to do this at the end of the date, you can give her a call later on that night or the next day. Please do not ghost a woman. That is the most cowardly thing a man can do. If you're not sure what to say, you can use my words. I really don't see this going anywhere. I don't know that I wanna go on a second date. It was great meeting you. That's it, simple, nothing. If you are interested, then you wanna convey that as well. Again, there's a chance you're gonna run into this woman. And if you're kind, if you're nice, if you're pleasant, she will be more than happy to refer you to her friends. So use your words, no ghosting, don't just disappear, none of that immature junior high school behavior. No, 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 don't do that. Be a man, use your words, use your words. So those are the tips. I will guarantee you if you follow them, every time you go on a date with a woman, you will do well. Women love this stuff. 
if you are interested in attracting the opposite sex, find out what the opposite sex wants, wants. And I will guarantee you those things I said to you are the things women want. Women, what do you think? If you're a female and you're seeing this video, am I off the mark? Do you think this is right? And I, I will have a video for women as well because, I mean, I know I beat up on men on this video, but I know women also do some really stupid things sometimes. So that video is coming up. Anyway, if you like it, if you like this video, if you thought the information was helpful, by all means, like it and subscribe because I will be sharing all sorts of crazy stuff with you. Anyway, have fun dating.